Well, hello, YouTube and everybody else. I'm going to show you real quick how to extend the trial period of Windows 7 from 30 days out to 120 days or four months. So you'd want to do this for any number of reasons. Um, if you need it, then it, here it is. Um, number one, when you install you, the version that you're going to use, do not activate it. Uncheck the box at install. Do not activate it. That's what you're trying to avoid until you save up enough money to buy a legitimate key. So once you've installed the version you want and you did not activate it, um, you know, three or four weeks, 29 days passes by and you would want to go to computer properties and I'm not going to bring that up but it would bring up this box and down here at the bottom on Windows activation it should say one day to activate. You'd want to wait till it got down to one day or zero days or whatever to do this process to get as much time as you can out of it. So at that point what you'd want to do is make sure you have the rearms at your disposal to use. That involves just typing in this into your start menu SL MGR dot VBS dash DLV and press enter at that point. What that'll do is bring up this box. It'll generate a script. It'll generate a bunch of information. Down here at the bottom, remaining rearm count, and it should say three if it's a fresh install and it's been a number of days. So that's how many times you have that you can do this procedure. So here's the procedure. It's fairly easy. Uh, there is one thing you do want to check before you do it. That involves opening up the Windows Registry Editor, going to HKLM Software, Microsoft Windows NT, current version, Software Protection Platform, highlight that and over to the right skip rearm needs to be set at zero most likely it will be set at zero but there are instances where it won't be if it's not right click go to modify and set it manually to zero and press OK now, I'm not going to do that because I don't need to do it so now that you uh, have done that the only thing left to do is go ahead and rearm and to do that you just need to open up a command prompt make sure it's an elevated command prompt where you run as administrator and the command to rearm is simply slmgr space dash rearm and press enter at that point. Now I'm not going to do it obviously because mine's already activated but you'll see one of three things. Most likely you'll see this. Completed successfully restart the system. So you'll restart and when you op open your system properties back up you'll be back up to 30 days. If it doesn't say that um, it might say this, but I mean, you might get this error. This is no real big deal. You just have to restart your computer and try it again. It should be fine. The only other thing you should see, I don't have it handy here, but it's a, just a message saying you're out of rearms. So that's all, that's all there is to it, guys. And uh, hopefully this helps somebody. If you need it, it's here. And uh, have a great day. Talk to you later.